Hello everyone! Today we have some exciting news, particularly for Samsung fans, as we dive into the latest developments surrounding the upcoming Galaxy S25 Ultra. First up, the Galaxy S25 Ultra is expected to feature satellite communication capabilities, a much-anticipated addition that allows users to send SOS messages in emergencies, even without standard network coverage. Recently, the Chinese version of the Galaxy S25 series received 3C certification, confirming the inclusion of this feature, specifically for the Galaxy S25 Ultra. However, the satellite SOS feature may not be available on the Galaxy S25 and S25 Plus models. In terms of charging, the S25 series will not include a charger in the box, although a charging cable will be provided. The S25 Plus and Ultra are expected to retain the 45-watt, super-fast charging technology, while the base model might feature 25-watt charging speed. As for performance, the Galaxy S25 Ultra is poised to outperform the iPhone 16 Pro Max. The US variant is likely to be powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 chip, confirmed by its recent appearance in the Deepbench database. It reportedly comes with 12GB of RAM and runs on Android 15. In Geekbench 6 tests, it achieved a single-core score of 3,690 and a multi-core score of 9,080, 18% higher than the iPhone 16 Pro Max's multi-core performance. As development continues, we can expect even better performance by the time it launches. The S25 Ultra will showcase a sleek new design with rounded corners and is said to include an impressive camera system, a 200-megapixel main camera, a 50-megapixel ultra-wide camera, a 10-megapixel telephoto camera, and another 50-megapixel super telephoto camera. It will feature a 5,000 mAh battery with 45-watt fast charging support. In addition to these specifications, there's a rumor about RAM upgrades across the S25 series. Leaker Ice Universe has confirmed that there will definitely be a 16GB RAM version of the S25 Ultra. This upgrade represents a significant leap from the Galaxy S24 Ultra, which offers 12GB across all storage variants. However, it's unclear if the 16GB option will be available for all storage configurations or only for higher-end models. Samsung has also announced that One UI 7 will be launched alongside the Galaxy S25 Ultra. The beta program is expected to start in December, as stated during the recent STC24 event. This update is eagerly awaited and will likely bring several enhancements to the user experience. That's all for today. What are your thoughts on these developments? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.